Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. This is your girl Sunny Kamal, aka Sunny Touch. Thank you guys for always believing in me. Thank you guys for always supporting me. If you are new to this channel, kindly subscribe and uh, share this video. Today, I want to show you how I make my homemade uh, detox. So guys, here we are in my kitchen. I will show you how I make my homemade detox. It's very easy. It's something that you can do at home. So with me, I have fresh lemon. It should be raw. Very, very fresh. Something else I really love is uh, this spice called ginger. This spice is medicinal and it has so many benefits. And of course, honey. I haven't been so lucky with uh, honeys that I've been purchasing lately. But guess what? I came across this honey and so far so good. I think this one doesn't have that uh, bottom layer, which is always sugar with the honeys that I've uh, been using before. So this honey for me so far is the honey that I'll be using for I don't know until when. And for the record, this video is not sponsored. All right, let's get started. Have your one lemon. Uh, cut into half, squeeze it, add one or two teaspoons of honey, depending on how sweet you want it, and of course add warm water. Mix and enjoy your concussion. So for ginger guys, I love to use ginger at night. You know, remember I always say that our body uh, acts, um, it, it produces new cells at a faster rate when you're asleep than when you're awake during the day, right? Because during the day, there's so many distractions. So I love using ginger at night because one, it's medicinal and it has so, so many benefits. So wash your ginger. There are those who peel, there are those who don't peel. Either way, it's still okay. And uh, crush it. Have your one lemon, cut into half, squeeze it, add one or two teaspoons of honey, depending on how sweet you want it. And of course, add warm water. Mix and enjoy your conclusion. Honey helps uh, act as an antibacterial. It helps to fight any infection that might be present in your body. Lemon, we know that um, it's a body cleanser. You know, it helps to restore and balance your body's pH. And of course, we know that lemon do provide us with nutrients such as vitamin C and B. Please, this as a morning conclusion is the best thing that has ever happened to me and ladies let me give you a tip you know that monthly period you know and uh because most women do get mood swings not just sometimes don't feel like talking to anyone i tell you guys this helps to boost my mood and i'm sure it will boost yours as well why don't you try it as you all know, I am a skincare blogger. I have my article on Eve Woman Standard about the untold truth of ginger and lemon. Okay, so I will leave the link down on my description box. Mm. Delicious. Anyway, guys, let me give you a story. <laughs> I love spices. Maybe now I I love 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 spices, but I realized I think like two months ago I'm not doing well with spices, not anymore. And it's not just me. I found out even my daughter whenever I cook with spices, um, she started getting brushes on her cheeks. And so the good thing. <laughs> Unajua, always make sure you have food that you'll always uh, go like, mm. if anything, this is what I'm suspecting. That I always say, people, understand your body, understand your body. When I say, uh, I've been using spices like, I think for the longest, 
But lately I realized like I'm even getting some pimples kidogo. You know, my daughter is having rashes. And of course, it's something that is healthy, it's something that we are consuming. And the reason why I'm saying this, it's because most of us blame the pimples and the rashes on the products. But remember, I always say you are what you eat. So always have this um, food that if anything, before you even complain about your product, check on what you're consuming. You guys can remember when I gave uh, an example about my sister who didn't do well with mutton as well. So guys, understand we all react differently. And most of the times, even when our skin is reacting and all that, it's from inside, it's through what we consume. And it doesn't mean whatever we are consuming is not healthy. It's very much healthy. And yes, we have to always make sure we check out, we check out on that. And always make sure you do this detox. This detox is very, very healthy and helpful because it will always neutralize, it will always flush out all the unwanted toxins. And again, the ginger uh, mixture, you know, ginger, uh, honey and water, that is what helped both my daughter and I. We no longer have, she no longer had the rashes, I no longer have my pimples, you know? And as much as I'm a, I'm a, skincare, I'm a skincare specialist, I'm a human being, you guys, okay? So it doesn't mean because I'm a skincare specialist, I can't get a pimple or something. No, I'm also a human being. And I go through the same thing some people, most of you, go through. And ginger worked perfectly for both of us. So let me enjoy my detox. And I hope you'll try it. And then come back comment let me know whether it worked out for you and of course i won't forget to leave you there the link from eve woman standard about the untold story about ginger lemon and water that one is when you have a flu so read through and see how you're supposed to go about it I hope you've enjoyed the video and you've learned something. Please don't forget to subscribe to this channel and of course comment, like and share. Until next time guys, bye for now.